What's good YouTube, it's Vex Reacts and I'm back with another reaction video and honestly you guys, I cannot even make this up. Like literally, God be choosing me at the perfect time to do the right things, bro. I literally just reacted to Han Jisung being the ace of all aces and now we have Han dropping a skiz record. Han 13? What does 13 symbolize? Please, if you know anything, let me know down in the comment section below. Number one, the cover art is nice and simple. We have the Han 13 but it's not too, you know, distracting and you know, we got Han right here looking good jean jacket hoodie combo nice nice let's get straight into it and see if the song and the lyrics will give us more insight on what Han 13 is supposed to mean okay I like the vibe let's go Han Hold up. Wait, is he okay? What's going on? Like Han is gonna have a legend. Matter of fact, let's keep it real. I want y'all to let re really like lock in, bro. We have to give these guys a round of applause every time they show out. I feel like these guys are gonna have legendary solo careers whenever they decide to go that route. When we when we really think about all of these members, all of them are immaculately amazing. They still going strong, and bro, I feel like the fact that I started reacting to Stray Kids Survival recently. And now I'm about to start trying to do Kingdom. If you don't know, tap in on the on the Patreon and follow me on social media. But I feel like the longevity of these guys are gonna be amazing, bro. I hope they continue to take care of their health. This man, Han, is really an ace, bro. D would you believe that this man is literally the one of the main rappers, bro? Not only main rappers, but he produced the music too, bro. Dang, bro. So not only is he going to have a good career because he's very talented, but he has experience producing, bro. I want Did he produce this song? It would only make sense, I feel like, bro. He might have had help from other people, but bro, this is immaculate. The vocals, obviously they was going to hit, bro, but even the message. He talking about like reminiscing about the happiness that, you know, he didn't felt in the past. And a lot of us have those moments where it's like, dang. I miss the good old days. I remember yesterday I had posted on the YouTube community tab about the old school like red car and you know going into the doctor's office and playing with the certain toys that you know I remember growing up bro. And it's like back in the day life was so simple but we didn't understand how simple it was. We didn't know that we was living in the simple times, the good times and the one thing that you got to learn whenever you go throughout life is right now is the simplest times bro. Right now is the simple time. If you in high school, you might be like, oh my God, like I'm tired of going to school. I'm tired of dealing with the same old stuff and doing the same routine over and over and over again. Like I want to be grown, bro. I promise you, you don't want these bills. <laughs> I promise you, you do not want these bills. You do not want to have to go to work every single day, a job that, you, that, that aggravates you, just like how school aggravates you. Picture that, except now and whenever you want food, you gotta pay for it. Mom, mom and them not about to cook. Mom and them about, not about to make, not about to go out there and buy the groceries. You gotta go out there and take the time to get the groceries, buy, make the food. You gotta clean up everything. You gotta pay the bills to make sure that you stay in the house. Yes, yes, it gets lethal. <laughs> it gets lethal. So 
You wherever you at in your life, you gotta enjoy the simple things. You gotta enjoy the moment that you're at right now because number one, it's gonna get more complex. And number two, don't take anything for granted. You living in the good times right now, bro. And it may be rough compared to the other times that you didn't had, but at the end of the day, bro, life is a journey that is worth living because through the ups and downs, it's all an experience, bro. This is dang, bro. And I love the the vocals, bro. That is how it is too. It's like it's like a little wave whenever you start getting down on yourself and you like you start thinking about the good times, it wash over you and eventually it go away and you start to think about those negative things again, but you got to understand that those things come and go like a wave, bro. so many memories and he really is like showing so much maturity bro on this track bro i love the line where he said like back in the day whenever he was like fully in love of whether it was a situation whether he it don't matter really matter what he's talking about he was talking about how he sacrificed certain things so that somebody else could feel a certain type of way so that somebody else could feel a type of love and I feel like as a man, I've always been that type of way, a selfless type of love. Like, you know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, the only way I want my relationship to be is it the and the perfect relationship is going to be a relationship where I show up and I'm selfless. That's how I view love, y'all. You know what I'm saying? The perfect situation is whenever I show up and instead of telling her, move, my arm is, you know, about to go to sleep. I ask her instead, are you comfortable? And if she comfortable, it don't really, you know, obviously I want to be comfortable, but it's not that big of a deal to let my arm go to sleep and sacrifice my, my comfort for her comfort. And in the ideal situation, you want somebody who go ask you back, are you comfortable? You know what I'm saying? And somebody that you could be truthful with and somebody who is going to pour into you. But whenever you look at it from a, a, a selfless perspective, you can't sit there and be mad or feel a type of way because somebody didn't reciprocate or get that back to you. That's just God showing you that that person not for you because it, the perfect situation is not going to be like that. When somebody show you their true character, take it for what it is, bro. If you being selfless and somebody being selfless, selfish, then obviously it's not going to work because you pouring into their cup and it's going to drain you. And you can't operate like that. If you're in a situation like that right now, do not allow yourself to operate like that because eventually you're going to lose yourself in somebody else who doesn't even care about your well-being, bro. Dang, bro. That's real. That's real. That's real, bro. That's real. I respect this. I love the vocals. The, 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 uh, ooh, Vex vocals. <laughs> Thank you. 
That was nice. So peaceful. So calm. So relaxing. Bro, this was a gift from Han right here, bro. This is one of them songs that you could play anytime for real, bro. I, I wouldn't recommend playing this in the gym, bro. But this one of them songs you lay in your bed, you put the song on, and you just look at the ceiling, and, and you just relax, bro. You think about the good times, bro. And don't allow, you know, anybody to take away the good moments. Just because y'all have some negative moments, or y'all fall out, or... You know, whatever the case may be, never allow nobody to take away from the good moments because those moments are so special, you guys. Like, don't take those moments for granted. Those moments where you, you're delusional, those moments where you're bliss and you just really, really, like, immersed in love, don't take that for granted. Just because you want to live like that forever, number one, it's never going to be like that. Once you get older and you realize that eventually that wears off, which... If it's true love in your heart, it never wear off because you you gonna always think of that person in the light of we've had these memories. And whenever you have, whenever you think of somebody as a culmination of the good memories y'all have, and you start to let go of the negative memories, that's when you gonna reach a place of peace and love. You know what I'm saying? So you know, obviously, it's not gonna be able to last forever. But whenever you do find that person, it is gonna last long enough to where you know that that's your person if that makes sense bro um but like i was saying bro don't allow anybody to take those good moments away from you and even though you know life may be rocky bro hold on to those good moments and use it as motivation to keep going never let that you know uh bog you down i want y'all to really go throughout y'all's life and i really like i really you know trying to get more personal with y'all and talk to y'all and you know show more personality like go throughout life and be ambitious bro you have no reason whatsoever and i'm talking to anybody out there who, who need to hear this message you have no reason whatsoever to feel you know down and out because literally the fact that you're here right now bro literally the fact that you're here right now it's a it's the world is horrible bro but literally the fact that you're here right now and you got the opportunity right now and tomorrow and the next day and the next day, you got the opportunity to improve, even if it ain't drastic. You know, even if you take it one step a day, eventually after you done took a step every single day, that's what you got to think of it as, bro. Don't get too anxious. I know how, how being anxious is. I'm an anxious person, bro. But even if I gain 10 subscribers every single day, bro, we making progress. And that's what life is about, making progress. Focus on the progress. Not the struggles, not the little moments. Get past it. Have amnesia. If you don't know what amnesia is, it's like short-term memory. Only have short-term memory whenever you're going through negative stuff. Bro, please, please, please. You have so many people who care about you, so many people who love you. I ain't going to be able to, you know, get back to everybody's comment, but I really do appreciate everybody. I really do love everybody because once you get to the point to where you realize that Everybody has their own struggles. Everybody got their own perspective, bro. We all in this together, bro. Like, for real, for real, bro. And you doing YouTube low-key helped me realize that. Like, we a team. We all in this together. I love y'all so, so much for bringing me into this world and um, allowing me the platform to spread positivity because that's something from a child. I remember being really, really young and praying to God, like, God, if you give me any type of platform, and I used to think I was going to go to the NFL, you know, I was one of those guys. <laughs> it's cringe, I know. I was one of those guys, but um, I remember telling God, like, from a little kid, I'm talking about being down on my knees and saying, bro, like, if you give me a platform, I promise I'm going to spread positivity. That's been my only goal since a kid, bro. And the fact that y'all gave me this opportunity, bro, is beautiful, bro. Don't let nobody... Anybody, I don't care if it's your parents, I don't care who it is, bro. Don't let nobody get you down as long as you're making progress in your life, bro. If you gotta make everything simple, bro, make it simple. You don't need to be doing no drugs, you don't have to party, you don't have to do nothing that everybody telling you to do, bro. As long as you're happy and fulfilled, that's what's gonna matter because nobody's living in your shoes. You know how you wake up every day and you're seeing everything through your two eyes and your perspective. Bro, that's special, bro. Nobody else ever, 
ever is going to be able to live that life, live in those shoes. So take that and run with that, bro. Make progress in your life, bro. If you want to achieve something, every single day you need to sit down. No days off, bro. No days off. You might, and don't think of it as, oh, I ain't going to never be able to relax. Because relaxation is key and pivotal to your progression, bro. You need to relax so that you can have enough fuel to go out there the next day and do what you got to do. Every single day, you need to be making progress. Whether that is relaxing, don't, don't go overboard now. Don't be relaxing every day. You still got to get out here and grind. But you know what I'm saying, bro. Every single day, make some progress. It don't have to be instrumental. It's not going to be like you're going to wake up into fame. It's not going to be like you're going to wake up and be a doctor tomorrow, bro. It's going to take some work. But as long as you are dedicated and you don't take no as an answer, bro, for as long as you live, you have to be dedicated and optimistic that every single day you go make progress and eventually you're going to look back and be like, dang, look at how far I came, bro. And take it serious. Love yourself. Like, really be involved with yourself and cater to yourself. And everything else is going to fall into place. I promise you, bro. I promise you, bro. Like, I remember growing up watching YouTubers and thinking, dang, bro. Like, that's so that's such a cool job. Like, that's such a cool thing to be able to live out. Like, to be able to do, like, make content. Like, I was always behind the camera. I used to take photos. Like, I remember doing YouTube videos seven, eight years ago, bro. Like, and now, like... Bro, look at how much I did just by, like, believing in myself, simply believing in myself. And, it, you know, you have days where you you don't believe in yourself, but you have to tell yourself, shut the hell up. Because this dream is deeper than just today. This dream is deeper than this one little situation I'm going through. And once you got that mentality, nobody other than yourself is going to be able to stop you, bro. And you got to believe that in your heart, bro. You can't let nobody take that 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 passion out of you because you know why you got that dream, bro. You know why you fell in love with that idea, bro. And don't let people, you know, take that away from you. Because that's your dream, not their dream. Who y'all got me riled up in here, bro. <laughs> Shout out for the subs. It oh, bro. <laughs> that's just more motivation. <laughs> I appreciate y'all so much, and I hope y'all have an amazing day. Um, keep y'all's head up. And just like I said in my last video where I was reacting to Han, bro, Take Han as an example and use him as motivation to be an ace in your own life, bro. Without further ado, I'm out. Peace and love always. Remember to be healthy. And like I say, go out there and do it, bro. You got the control over your life. You have the control. The world does not have control. Look at me right now while I'm telling you this. The world does not have control over you. You have the control. All of the things that you can't control, stop trying to control those things. Only try to control the things that you can control. You can control when you get up. You can control when you go to sleep. You can control what you decide to eat. You can control how much effort you put out. Control the things that you can control and let everything else go. And give it to God too, bro. Make sure you're praying. Make sure you, you know what I'm saying? I'm out, y'all.